Hello, this is a charity shop haul. My name is Kate and I'm going to show you everything I found in the last week or so at charity shops in Norfolk. So I've been to Great Yarmouth, Caister, Stalham, and I think that's it actually. I think it's just three or four different uh, charity shops, but I've got lots of items to show you. Some stuff is uh, Christmassy and I've got some normal bits and pieces as well, but lots of um, lovely bargains to show you. Before I start my video, I'm gonna do my mug of the day and um, here it is. It's from Monday because today is Monday. I'm recording this in advance to put on for Wednesday, which is when you're watching it. And because I'm currently doing Vlogmas and I'm on Vlogmas day 17 and there isn't time um, to do a video and edit it so this is a no edit video so this is just in one take so it might be a bit hickledy pickledy but hopefully we'll get through it together and it will be fine so I'm just going to show you my mug of the day but you might have seen it already in vlogmas day 17 um it's from Poundland it's a little reindeer and he's got a jumper on it's just so sweet isn't it and I've got a coffee so this is my mug of the day again because he's come back again for today and my jumper I also wore obviously on Monday because it is Monday when I'm filming this this was from a charity shop and I got it last Last week at Caster in Sue Ryder and it's got I think it's like an original 80s jumper it's got funny tassels on the arm there and tassels like at the bottom of the jumper and but I think it's really nice colors so something I love about it and there's something I think oh it's a little bit weird um I've had some comments I put a picture on um Instagram and some people love it and other people said I like it but the tassels are a bit funny because they're it's not the flat, most flattering jumper, but it's kind of nice, isn't it? So let me know if you think it's terrible or if you've liked it, but I think I've already done this in Vlogmas Day 1. So if, if you've already let me know, then, then don't worry. But it's got some nice little um, patterns on it, like little... Oh, I'm not showing you very well. Little houses, there you go. Houses and a, and a tree. So it's very festive, it's sweet. And I think it's an original 80s one. Look, If you look at the label, that looks like an old, like an 80s label, if you know what I mean, doesn't it? So I haven't seen, I don't know... I've never heard of that. Um, so that's enough about my jumper, although it is from a charity shop, so it's kind of fitting that it's a charity shop haul. I'm gonna get on with the items because I'm babbling on and I can't edit myself because this, this is a one take. Um, I'm gonna start off with a couple of items I found in, there's a new charity shop um, called Priscilla Bacon in Stalham, and it was done out really nicely and they've not been there for very long. So I'm gonna go back and support them and take them some items and, and hopefully buy some more. But this was two pounds, it's a little scarf and it's a really good make, it's, it's that make there. Lamb's wool, it's a Scottish one, isn't it? Yeah, made in Scotland, so it's pure wool, little tartan scarf, and it's just really sweet, really cozy. And I think Mr. Carrington has got one like this, but a red one. So this reminded me a bit of his scarf. And here's another YouTuber. If you like sort of charity shop hauls, thrifty hauls, Poundland hauls, um, he does all of those. And he's just very funny as well. He's a good friend of mine. So I'll link his um, channel in the description if you want to go and watch um, his video. So yeah, that was two pounds. And what else did I get from there? Oh yeah, the little Christmas decoration here. It's a little handbag. That was from the same charity shop. And that was um, 50p for that little handbag decoration. I put a picture on Instagram of that the other day and people loved it. And on Instagram, I'm Kate McCabe. If you want to come and follow me there, I'll link it in the description. And I've also got a house account called Kate's Homely Home, but they'll both be in the description if you want to um, come and follow me on there. Right, okay. I've also got this for my dog, Rufus. It's a little uh, dog Santa jumper. That was from Sue Ryder in a case then it was three pounds 49 so i'll see if rufus wants to wear it um i'll put him in it in a i'll, I'll make him i'll try and make him wear it in a vlogmas video but if he doesn't want to um i won't force it on him so i'll see if i'll see how he goes i'll try and put it on him but if he gets a bit freaked out i won't bother us but i will try because he would look so cute in it so hopefully we'll see rufus in that little jumper um oh what's that but he's a rescue dog so he gets a bit scared because, um, you know, he's he's much better than he used to be. He used to be really sort of skittish and scared of everyone, but he's so much better. But, you know, he might be a bit scared of the jumper. And talking of um, rescue pets, these were from um, RSPCA in Stalham. That was, I think that was a pound and that one was 50p or it could be the other way around. Little Christmas tree decorations and they're like all handmade, little felt decorations. They're really cute. And this was a pound from the same shop. Um, just set of three white and silver baubles because you can never have too many um, Christmas tree decorations. So I've got those as well. And um, oh, down here I've got a couple of things, Christmassy items, a little decoration, and that was a pound. So I'm just going to put a little candle on top of that. I'll probably put this candle 
on top of it. So that was a pound. This was also a pound. Um, this little candle, that was from one of the charity shops in the Stalham. So you might have already seen that um, in one of the vlogmasuses the other day. So I'll probably put that on top of there and like use that over Christmas. Um, yeah, so I've got some books for my mum. These were three for two pounds. And it's quite a good um, idea. So if you want to get someone some books for Christmas, but you don't want to spend a lot, you haven't got enough, lots of money, um, just have a look in the charity shops because they've got loads of good books and they're usually really reasonable. And if someone loves reading, then give them some books and they will be very happy. So I've got three of these for my mum. These all look brand new to me. They're in really good condition. Um, that one is called Getting Colder. I thought it said older then. Yeah, Getting Colder. And I've read the back and that looks good. I've also got uh, this one called Elizabeth is Missing. And then I've got, I'm going to sneeze. Hang on. I'm going to, oh, oh. <coughs> ah. No edit video, so I can't edit the sneeze out. But we all sneeze, don't we? Okay, right. And this is um, a Carrie Hope Fletcher book. And she is a YouTuber, isn't she? I've seen some of her videos or I think I've seen her in Louise Pentland's videos um on the other side and that's meant to be good isn't it and it reads really nicely so these are all for my mum for Christmas so hopefully she will like them and I can borrow them off her to read like in the summer I mainly just read in the summer on holidays I'm not very good at reading outside of holidays I can't really switch off very well but I love reading on holiday I read like a couple of books a week I know that's not that many but I, I enjoy reading I enjoy reading on holiday. Right, what else have I got to show you? Some Christmas decorations. I'm just going to have some of my coffee. I hope that's okay. So if you have one, uh, you're welcome to have a little drink as well. But you don't have to. Could just be me. Okay, right. So these little decorations were a pound each. I think they're brand new. I don't know where they're from originally. They're just little, like, houses. They're cute, aren't they? So I thought I would get the two different ones. A little ski lodges or something. Um, so they were a pound each. I don't know where they're from originally. They've got a little a little tag on them, so I don't know where that's from originally. It doesn't tell me, but they yeah, they were a pound each. And all of these were from Sue Ryder, these little decorations. Um, this one was a pound, so it's a little snowman. I do love a Christmas tree decoration. I've gone a little bit bonkers this year. I normally only buy a few each year but I've bought quite a lot and my mum needed some extras so I had to get some for her these were 69p each little um robin and a little post box with a robin they're cute aren't they little decorations yeah some of them are for my mum I got these I don't know why because I was gonna I was thinking about wearing them at the I went to um had a night out and I thought I might wear them but I didn't end up wearing them but they were a pound some tights and it says they, they're body shape tights so they might make me look like all shapely and nice so I'll try those out they might be too big but I thought for a pound I would grab them and then this little decoration was 50p some Christmas berries and I was meant to put these in my Christmas wreath I've got on the back of the door so I still might I'll put them over there and hopefully I'll, I'll put them in the little I've got um like a real it's not a Christmas well, it's like a Christmas tree wreath you know with little branches off a tree so it smells really nice so little pine branches but I haven't decorated it it just looks pretty and smells nice um what else have i got to show you okay so i got some shoes is that all the bits and bobs i think it is just got some shoes to show oh got, oh i've got some 10p christmas decorations some tinsel and a couple of um items of clothing but these shoes i thought were a real bargain they are from jones Bootmaker, and they're in really good condition and they're like leopard leopard print or tiger print Maybe it's leopard print isn't it um and they were three pounds and they're kind of they feel feel funny if you can see you know they're like like hairy if that makes sense don't know if that does make sense but they look i think they look really nice with a pair of like black jeans or black crop jeans so i wear them when it starts getting a little bit warmer hopefully i do like a bit of leopard print and i got some bargain decorations for 10p each so everything in here i'll probably show you during the vlog because there's too many here and i don't want to like run out of time um but these were all 10p you might have seen in the vlog there was a whole box of them i went to buy the whole box but he wanted too much money so i just chose the ones that i actually needed which probably was better because i just didn't need all the other things but little sprigs like this um ones like that they were all 10p that one was 10p which is really cute isn't it like little wooden mini Christmas wreath. Mr. Carrington would like that one. 
Um, there's a little star and what else is in here? Another bauble, another one of them, a gold, a gold one, some bells for 10p. Oh, I think that's it. So I have actually shown you. So yeah, 10p each of those little decorations. And I also bought some tinsel from the same, it was like a youth shop. It said like for the youth, Stalham youth football team or something lots of bits of tinsel for 10p eight, 10p each and I'm going to put those on the bottom of the stairs no yeah I am we've got some tinsel around the bottom of the stairs like on the banisters but I'm just going to continue that on um around and then like down on the stairs towards the hallway so I'm going to put that on there in a minute and then this was 10p it's like tinsel but it's pom-pom tinsel and I've never seen this before it's all like tangled which is probably why someone um, donated it but I, if I can untangle it that would be really nice so I will try and do that this afternoon I might give it to my mum because she's good at like untangling so I'll see if she's up for doing that it might be too difficult I don't know either way that's there'll be something nice I can do with that or Mr Carrington or Vanessa would know wouldn't they they'd probably do something amazing with that um right so just going to get onto the clothes I've got three things to show you before the end of this no edit haul so I hope it's been okay um this is a little Christmas jumper and it's from Sense it was four pounds fifty it's got little polar bears originally it's from Avenue whatever that is and it was um brand new like normally so four pounds fifty for that and that'll be one of my Christmas jumpers I might wear that tomorrow actually That'll be yesterday if you're watching this on Wednesday. I really like the colours, navy blue with pink and white. And then this is a really snuggly, like, pyjama -y top. I think this is from Sainsbury. So it's like a fleece, navy blue um, stars fleece jumper. And this is from RSPCA, and that was 2 99 So I love wearing things like this around the house because they're just really cosy, and our house is freezing. It's so really cold. Like when it was um, over the weekend, there was Storm Deirdre, I think she was called. You could literally feel the wind coming in through the Georgian windows. It was like they were open. It was like, it's that cold, but you can't change the windows because um, they're listed and they're beautiful. And the final item I'm gonna show you is this Jules dress, which is such a good find. It was three pounds. You can see there, three pounds for this lovely Jules dress, size 12. I couldn't believe it when I found it. And it's got pockets. It's dark gray, it's really thick, like jumper material. And yeah, I was happy to find it. And the man said, oh, that's a good buy for three pounds. Cause Sue Ryder, their prices have just changed. They used to be three for two. Um, and now they're like three, two, one. So everything is three pounds, two pounds or one pound. So they've kind of changed it, which is great when you find an item like this, um, a lovely Jules dress for three pounds. And you just have to be there at the right time, don't you? The right time, the right place, and you can find some amazing bargains. Yeah, and that is a size 12. I showed, did I show you that? I don't know. But there we go. So that is my charity shop haul. That's everything I've got to show you. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope the no edit was okay. I'll probably like watch it back going, but there's nothing I can do about it. It's all done now. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching. Let me know what your favorite item was in this haul. I think I've shown you everything. You always feel like that you've left something out, but I don't think I have. If you enjoyed the video, give it a like. And if you haven't subscribed, uh, make sure you do. And I will speak to you soon. Another Vlogmas for tomorrow. And they're going to continue up until Christmas Eve. So the last one will be on, on Christmas Eve. And then for Christmas Day, I've got a special no edit best bits video. So I'll put that on probably like a midday on Christmas day. So loads of videos to come. Thank you very much for watching. We've got through the no edit. I'm going to drink the rest of my coffee and going to get on with Vlogmas Day 17 and I'll speak to you soon. Thank you so much again um, for watching or commenting and, and liking videos and just, just being there. So thank you very much. Happy Christmas. See you later. Bye. Bye from the mug of the day. Bye.